Welcome to Date with Danu right here on Hi TV, your luxury channel. Once again, I sit on this seat to ask atrocious questions and somebody decides to pay me for it. Well, not, not exactly, but anyway, I'm super happy to do this show. Today I have three young, vibrant people adding so much of color into our lives in terms of entrepreneurship, education, uh, social interaction and so much more. Let's get on with the show. Hi, I'm Dishneera. Hi, I'm Shahan. We're here to go on, on a date with, with Danu. <laughs> Hi, I'm Sam Rupasinghe and I'm here to go on a date with Danu. This is the first time on the show, so hoping Danu becomes like very nice to me. And uh, <laughs> Danu will be forgiving to us. <laughs> yeah, so try to do our best. <laughs> Danu is absolutely nasty, snarky comments, but he's too fun. And so I'm happy to introduce these very young, older to me guests on the show. <laughs> just, yeah, just wanted to say that so that you know we know the age yeah. is there. So let me start. I have Dishnira in the middle there. Dishnira, please give a moment for your uh, accessory. <laughs> <laughs> Star the show. Yeah, there you go. That's that's stunning. Then we have Shehan, who is Dishnira's <laughs> half. Yeah. The better half. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Thank you. I didn't oh. want to say that and just get hammered on the side. <laughs> <laughs> then we have Senuri. I'm sure you would have seen so much of her in so many different uh, outfits. So we have Senuri, uh, who also recently graduated. You are now a? Um, graduate. In? Bachelor's of Law. <laughs> so she can sue us in style. All right, so welcome to the show. We have lots to talk about. To start things off, I'm going to start with the couple who is seated right next to me. So we have Dishni Ryan Shehan. So they run a store called uh, Thambili Island. If I'm sure you would have been there and like purchased some of these very nice summer dresses. And he's the founder of Culture Bayari. These, these kind of Sri Lankan vibe outfits have been trending, as you know. People in Sri Lanka are now actually loving the fact that they can purchase things which are locally produced. Uh, to start things off, y'all are so young and none of y'all studied fashion. What in the world did y'all think of doing this? <laughs> mm. Yeah, she studied finance, I also studied finance and marketing. Yes. And here we are doing a fashion label. I think I, I, I genuinely like to see prints and like colorful things. Okay, Just I can see you're so colorful today. This is so wrong. <laughs> <laughs> so I found myself shopping online a lot once I came back. That's the problem to have. Studying. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> and you know, I was thinking, how come these things aren't produced here, right? I and know. we have so much. Correct. Yeah, and easy access, and like. Yeah. 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 So. That that's, was the start. That's kind but of how you all never visualized it when you were growing up, you know, I'll eventually get into like first level of design because there are people who do like back office you can do like yeah. finance for a design label yeah. but not exactly be in the front running creating this yeah. type of merchandise that we see so who sort of comes up with all of this okay let's start with Thambili Island yes, now please. when when you got into Thambili Island you were with him but yet did you ever think that there'll be a culture by Ari as well or culture by Ari came first so we started Thambili Island, and then about a year later, yeah. we started culture. Ah, you followed. Yeah. Ari. <laughs> no, but he comes from like a textile background. Yeah, so correct. he kind of like helped me get started, figure out where to source fabric. Yeah. I even to Petah for the first time. <laughs> 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 How was that experience? <laughs> it, was, it, was, it was good. It was good. I was wow. fascinated. <laughs> um, it was amazing. And so now we have found um, good suppliers that we like source directly from. And um, quality is what we've really been focusing on. Um, producing a really quality garment at an affordable price. Yeah. And also, uh, the, this whole thing about, you know, shelf life being short for outfits is something that has been discussed for so long. The fact that, you know, uh, the, the, the reason that we are going to, you know, just end up putting all of this into landfill, which has been a bit of a concern of all this fast fashion. Uh, how would you all keep those in mind when so you're... So, we are actually not fast fashion brands. We are actually more of a slow fashion in between. Um, so, it's all community produced. So, we work with smaller artisans and we produce smaller quantities. And, like I said, we produce a very quality product. So, I think you can use, use it for it a long for time. A long time. Yeah. yeah. And Sri Lanka being an island, uh, you know, like it's... All year round, you can wear. Right. Yeah. Yes. It's summer friendly at any given day. Exactly. And what she's wearing right now is a couture garment. Yes. 
Hanbili Island. Hanbili Lux. Yes. Do I know that? Yeah. She told me, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, Senori Rupa Singh has been the face of many things. Um, sh that sounded so bad. <laughs> <laughs> but you live a very organized life. I have noticed that, oh, you just do it for the gram. Like, you know, I've always wondered all these, you know, I, I have never done a waking up video. My God, I look like I got hit by a train. It's terrible. So like, my dog bad. is yawning on one side. <laughs> like, you know, part of my clothes are barely there. And, you know, it's not a nice thing. But whereas you seem to do those, like in the mornings, you are eating chia seeds and then running to the gym and then you are off going for a meeting, then you are studying, then you are shooting, then you like how in the world do you live your life? Well the thing is I, I live it until I crash and burn and take a vacation for about like a week. Right, so, so. but that is your routine, you literally live like a very condensed, planned, uh, fully utilized timeline life. Sort of, also I can't take a break, like even on like rest days when it's training. I feel like a complete loser for some reason. I feel like, okay, I don't need to rest, I need to do something. So, I don't think I'm used to it, it's always been like a... I do say Rap Trace is not supposed to be your theme song for the life run, but I end up being there, but not... I'm not running to anyone's rhythm, it's my own rhythm, but it feels like a rap... You're a rat. Something like that, but I get my work done, but I, but I need a routine too. Like, Obviously, it's not the same thing because I'm engaged in different areas, right? But still, there is routine. I, I what make time up do you my wake week. Up? I don't have a time. It depends on work, right? Yeah. Sometimes there's a shoot at, let's say, 8, and I can't train in the evening. I have to make sure I train at 4 in the morning. So. Oh, you work out every day? I try my best. <laughs> like One you. of those people, right? Like okay, okay. Yeah, that's, like that. that's, that's like therapy. Therapy okay. is expensive. Mm. Gym feels less expensive. It's like <laughs> one year membership. Have you tried eating a nice good donut? Mm. It's the same thing. Best therapy ever. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> I think you do that as well, right? I do that she too. works out and then she but I'm it's not good to have a I'm not hundred percent healthy. Yeah. It's not like look, I'm gonna have chicken breast and broccoli every single oh day. God, I don't want to sit anywhere close no. to you because if you by any chance put some gas out, I'll die. <laughs> 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 oh, that's, <serious>? that's, um, <laughs> that's um, broccoli that I don't want to be there for. <laughs> true, true. But then, do donuts there. Donuts there. There you go. Uh, now, this lady who is seated in the middle is extremely artistic uh, and very much attention to detail. We'll speak about it when we do come back. But right now, we get into our first segment where they walk away with gifts from our great wow. friends at MasterCard. If you're planning on going and shopping at Thambili Island, no, it's now it's Thambili. Thambili culture. 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 <laughs> it's Thambili culture. You can now just go, <laughs> just tap the card and purchase your goodies. Let's get into our first segment. This is Tap and Go. <laughs> Alright, so we have these questions. You may think these are such very basic questions for your very smart um, what, uh, accounting, finance brains uh, and law, law brain. Let's see if you get it right. <laughs> How it works, you need to tap. Okay. First person who taps gets to answer first. Whoever has the highest score wins this fabulous gift box from our friends at Mastercard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I've watched a lot of telemarketing. <laughs> I can see that. Right, let's go. Who was the first Disney princess? Sleeping Beauty, Cinderella, Bella, Snow White. Where did oh. we right, right, right. Now, just answer now. Wait, you know that? <laughs> you just Bella. did it, did you? Huh? Bella, I'm just ballparking. What is it? Do you even know who Bella no, is? <laughs> who in the world is Bella? I also don't know Bella. I know the other people. Snow White. Snow White. Yeah, I think it's Snow White. Congratulations. You win the prize. I don't know why you disturb their whole flow yeah. by just tapping for no reason. I just want to win. <laughs> <laughs> okay. How many stars are on the Chinese flag? They are very close to our country. Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, no. Four. You um, are a, you are literally just a time killer. Yeah. About uh, maybe seven. No. Five or seven. <laughs> De decide on the answer. Five. Five. Seven. <laughs> Visualize correct. <laughs> Five. Oh. I didn't, I didn't even what try is it. a group of crows called? A school, a drove, a herd, a murder. 
A murder. Two. Well done. <laughs> How many hearts does an octopus have? One, two, three, four. Four. This has to be correct now. We'll move on. <laughs> oh my God. No. Maybe two. Wrong. Damn it. Say it now. <laughs> Wait, I, is, what, what were the answers? Four and two were there. Then. Oh, right. What's left? So one and three. <laughs> oh. Oh. Holy. The way he said it, I feel like that in between. I don't know. I'm going to go with one. Wrong. Three? Three. three. Really? Yeah. Mm, I'm sorry, wrong. guys. I just... <laughs> but he has it was hearts. So... Uh, ah, that's true. Indicates that's it true. might be plural. Who provided the voice of Groot? Oh. Vin Diesel. <laughs> I know that's the answer. That has to be correct. Yeah. <laughs> I've been waiting for this moment now. Unfortunately, <laughs> although you got that right, thank congratulations you. to Senuri for winning <laughs> two. Thank you, thank although you. Although it was just by chance, <laughs> I personally feel the only person who deserves the win is Shehan. Right? Fair point. Thanks, guys. Thank you. But I will let Senuri decide it. <laughs> congratulations. No it's all yours. That you all share. Okay, you all go home Master and share. It. Okay? Uh, we are getting into a break. Thank you, Mastercard, for being with us on the show. We are getting into a break. We'll see you after. Welcome back to the show. So, in this very cluttered world of um, entrepreneurship, fashion, clothes, people leaving this country, nobody to buy things, it, it's a hard place to be. How do you all keep the business afloat? We ship overseas so ah, they can good. still travel. Because and buy there. Yeah, move. And then it's more reasonable, no? Yeah, true. In dollars, in yeah. USD. And Good also choice. being AUD. making new designs and patterns and not doing a larger quantity of the thing and people get fed up of like yeah, buying true. the same thing. And you thing don't want everyone to be in the same thing. No? Yeah. You're like, and especially Colombo is very small. small. Yeah, Colombo is very small. Sri Lanka. Yeah. So we try to do unique, different pieces that makes everybody feel confident, looks amazing. Yeah. I'm pretty sure if you go out, like, Anywhere you'll at least see two to three people wearing the same thing, right? So don't want to. We try to avoid that, that and yeah. make things more unique. Yeah, um, Senuri, how did this? Now this Instagram world is like you know it's still running very strong, but it's going to crash and burn at one point. You know, there's there's so much that you can take yeah. as information. That's Everyone is promoting something. Like when you're promoting a soap, there are five other people promoting some other soap. So what does the consumer end up buying? It's a bit of a problem. It is a bit of a problem, yeah. but also it differs who does the promotion and also your market, right? It's because even influencing, with me, I'm not promoting it to the mass market, but there are influencers who does it that way. So with my audience, I know what they want, so it's my duty to only get the products that works for my audience when it comes to promotions. Right. I really don't promote all the products because of that very reason. Because there's no point in me asking, I mean, getting my compensation from the client for something they're not going to get at the end of the day. It, it's a cycle, right? I mm. give them, they get it from me. So that's how it works. But yeah, it's not going to last a long time. In this field, too. don't you think Instagram is really easier for women to reach the audience faster? It is. It why? Is. Why it is, is that? You know, why? Like, I, I have, I have shown everything. No, <laughs> no, no. But why is that? But statistically, what? I think there's more women on Instagram. Yeah, than and also in terms of, uh, in terms of the following, also it's so much more faster. Growth is more solid. Have you ever re thought of it? To be honest, not really. Yeah, I don't think it's because I don't know a lot of male influences as well compared to right? they compared to female influences. Yeah. So I, I never really stopped and thought about it. But I guess women also just just like putting out there. There's also much more detail when it comes to uh, female influences content. Okay, like there's more care in what they do. There's more care, there's more storyline to it. Okay, maybe not storyline. I've, I've seen like really good storylines with male uh, influencers, <laughs> so I'm going to take that back. But more detail, there's more, there's more, much more to it than just the product itself. Like even the car cover of the product, let's just take like a random soap, cake of soap, they would, they would showcase like the border. 
like if you look closely, they would do that as well. So sometimes it's more like, look, what is she going to show in the product? What is this marketing going to be? It's always different. It's not going to be the same thing. Mm. So maybe because of that, I'm assuming. Yeah. Talking about social media marketing, these two brands grew only using social media. Yes. Instagram you're, business. Yeah, you're a literally social media platform. Mm. What can I say? Oh. Mm. Users. Yeah. <laughs> to yeah, proof that social media actually works. Yeah, uh, and also it's never about the quantity of followers as well. It's no. not like yeah. you need to have a million to have like a good sale. No. It's about having the right amount of people, uh, right market. Let's speak about, I'll speak about culture because I think culture was one that was very heavy in terms of online marketing. How, what made you sort of take that path and only that path? So when you didn't have marketing budgets, okay, no, then? didn't have marketing <laughs> <Yeah>. budgets. <laughs> Definitely. That I understood, yeah. Uh, when, so when I started, it was like, I remember the, you reached out to me also, Danu, one time. No, no, I didn't. Okay. You did. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, we were just uh, going on about it for like, a while without spending a lot on marketing mm. but then when we started not many brands were so, uh, instagram wasn't like shopping correct you know it was yeah. just posting pictures posting stories and influencers coming through the culture was the first like business on tiktok yes oh, wow. so actually working with somebody on a shoot yes. and they were like why do you need tiktok and then she, she this one of these influencers just like asked me is like why why are you on tiktok and then i was like just it's another platform because people didn't really understand the concept of Correct. social media, what it can do. And this is not a long time ago. We are talking about what, five yeah, years five, ago? Yeah, five, six years ago. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I think that really, I really understood that part of the business when people were spending on all the other platforms like t television, radio, all that. Don't ditch television. Right? No, Sin. it's not. It's still, Sin for it's still television. good. Right? I'm there still. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but we couldn't afford television. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Then that's true. Like small like companies the couldn't. The yeah. And it, it he helped like startups to sort of use this platform. Yes. And you use your friend to uh, wear the shirt, yes. took some pictures. Yeah. And that's the journey. That's how it started. Ended up now we have people depending on our business and we are helping a lot of people. And that's amazing. That's amazing. How yeah. was it for you when you were going on with Tambili Island? So I think probably for like the first year, we were very like low key. Mm. I think it was just, you know, I was, I was very happy. Like, but, yeah, you, know? like you had like 10 yeah. garments and them going off. You were just yeah, Content and we, were, we used it. to do pop ups. Yeah, pop ups. Okay. That was yeah. Yeah. I remember those. Yeah, I remember we used to do dance out pop ups. It was yeah. like Paka Jeep. Uh, so we like made up own rack and everything. And then, <laughs> and then I would set it up and they should come and hang the clothes. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, we would have like all, say, if we do in down south, and we'll have so many people come in and buy. And some pop ups, no sale. Some, uh. yeah. But then it the really got, good, yeah. got yeah. us into it really like, uh, you know, customer interaction. It's really nice. Yeah. Um, and I think. What's interesting about social media is now you can directly, um, customer can directly um, reach out to the brand and like speak, You have an right? interaction. I think that that interaction is what I think really like helps. Correct. Because yeah. even still, like um, for Sri Lanka, them going and directly ordering online, they would still want to chat and then go and place Correct. their order, you there's know? Always this, there's always this doubt about this whole online, putting my credit card and purchasing, there's always yeah. that fear factor. Still in Sri Lanka, yeah. people tend to get scared to use credit cards. Correct. But, I, uh, but I see, I think maybe with COVID, I see a lot of, Lots like that of shift that was to my shopping next, online. Next point, no. yeah. how COVID, <laughs> literally COVID, yes, crippled a lot of things, but at the same time, it grew a lot of things. We'll speak about it when we do come back. It's time for a break. It's time to take a breather. Mm -hmm. We'll see you after. Welcome back to the show. It's a date with Danu. And right now we have a title's partner, uh, Crystal Luxury Wellness. Uh, they're on board with us. Um, you know, Shehan. <laughs> <laughs> I complimented you. Ah, sorry. <laughs> no, I'm just saying you might love some of these products. Mm. It could be Can't of great to use try. to you. Yeah. <laughs> Crystal. Oh, she looks. You can't always. You know, use her glow to make you look good. Yeah. You need but to stand. But I introduced him to skincare. Uh, how was the soap. introduction? The introduction was very nice. Very <laughs> now, comforting. like slowly, you know, I'm like, uh. use a cleanser. Oh, Back wow. then, before I met her, it was only soap. No, yeah. that is painful. Your skin must be just oh. crying. Skin everywhere, just soap. Yeah, 
that those are fine. from here onwards you <laughs> use whatever even cow dung is fine but just uh, this part may be just concentrated a little bit okay oh he ices his face ah yeah <laughs> I can't. Yeah. all right then let's start with these these are some very tough questions one or two have been put specifically for few of you this is called hot seat <laughs> okay Okay. Right, let's go. This question is for all three of you. If you had to describe the following people using a Sri Lankan dish, uh, like a Sri Lankan curry, which curry would you be picking <laughs> for the following? Basil Rajapaksa. Mm, ala curry. Ala? Yeah. Basil. I don't know, like, makara curry. No, like you can that? just say but I don't know, I'm thinking uh, like black pork curry. I don't know. <laughs> what? What is it? Black pork curry. Did you say black pork, pork curry? Is it pork curry? Black pork curry for basil. Dinakshi Priyasad. Oh, I don't know about that. It's okay, but, but she's but really sweet. She's like a sweet potato. Okay. Yeah. She's sweet. She's very nice. Carrot. <laughs> okay. Uh, I can't even think of something. But she's really sweet. Yeah, so so like a um, sweet, like sweet concept. You, you know, can even curry? be a Sri Lankan it's, it's oh, a Sri Lankan dessert. Sweet. Yeah. Oh, like Pani Vala do. Pani Vala. Yeah. Pen girl. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Pumi Hansamali. I actually don't know her. I haven't met her. Um, You're good friends. Um, what the hell? Ah. Oh. Dal curry. Dal curry. Dal curry. Don't think about it so much. What's the first thing that comes to your mind? Tibbatu. Huh? Tibbatu. Tibbatu? <laughs> you eat some strange things. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I really do. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Shia? Bambatu. Bambatu? Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Our, uh, <laughs> I didn't say it. Live with Bambatu, <laughs> right. Uh, Maitri Pala Sirisena. Mm. That's a whole buffet. That's like. a buffet? <laughs> <laughs> but no, good Ra rice. 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 And curry. rice. Rice, just rice. Just rice. Just rice. Just rice. <laughs> String hoppers. Okay. You don't like Made string hoppers? Made out of rice. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Thank you. That's flimsy, right? That's yeah. what I do. Oh, ah, <laughs> like that. Oh, shit. I should. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shehan, yes. Vishnira, I really don't want to know how you know things are flimsy yeah. with my palsy <laughs> yeah. Let's just go with it, Dano. Just, just now I know how you touch. do your market <laughs> <laughs> on Instagram. <laughs> String hopper vibes. Knowing what's flimsy and not. Oh, Lord. No. Are you flimsy, Shan? No. <laughs> She's not saying anything. <laughs> but you are Shan. Yeah, but I wanted to know whether you are. <laughs> this is just lost right now. All right, here we go. This is the two of you. Ranshan, Jake. Saranga Danu. Rank the above mentioned lineup of men according to your preference Why as they have all born culture. Oh, you uh, included uh, yourself. Anyway. I think that's a question for Shay. Yeah, but you might have to endorse it as well because okay. you're very much part of the brand. Like who looks better in like the face? According to you. You rank them. Me. Yeah, first to fifth. First to fifth. I think you should know the first answer by yeah, now. Yeah, first one is you, Danu. Right? <laughs> right, guys? Yeah. And Don't uh, just say it for the sake of, because that, that's very painful. Just say. Now, if I say you second or something, then... That's okay. Uh, I'm not going to hold it again. This is a... This I'm going to call it evening no. saying, oh, you... This is a fair <laughs> world and freedom of speech turn. is guaranteed. You will get to okay, I think, I think Ranshan, because he has been... He styles them for weddings. Right. You see him in a suit. He'll yeah. style it for a wedding. Uh, he'll style it for anything, actually. Okay. Ranshan, so, Ranshan. Danu. Saranga. Saranga. Jake. Jake. Fine, then it's Ranshan. Sorry, I'm going miles <laughs> away. Hey, but you haven't worn culture to a wedding, no. That I've worn it on TV. Yeah, <laughs> but still, like, you know, with a suit. What is a wedding? Just two hours. <laughs> no, but you know, you can this style is it lifetime. with a suit and it looks nice. <laughs> I am the one who first styled it with a suit. Say no. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Super salt. Hot, <laughs> hot seat. Hot seat is that? I can feel the heat. Answer. Would you rather be stuck in an elevator with Mahela or Sangakara? Sangakara. 
Two people you think should be guests on date with Dhanu. Two people, what? You think, you should, think be should be guests on date with guests on oh. date. You had a lot of people. Yeah, that's yeah, the thing. Just tell who you all think. So not somebody you've already had. Anyone is fine. Ah. Uh. But, uh, Ranshan will... for the sixth time. <laughs> oh yeah, again in a culture shirt. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. Yes, and and a, and and a suit. suit. You should also wear a culture shirt. <laughs> Continue. Oh. Who else? Can, oh, really? can you all answer individually without having like a group discussion <laughs> about this? I feel like it's a group discussion. Right? Yeah, but can we also like right? quick, like pass in the space? Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying. Any humans? You haven't had any like politicians, no? I've had. Okay. Okay, never mind. I can't think of any. You should put them in. Yeah. Fine. We are moving on from that question. Sorry. Who do you think is an overrated politician? Wow. I'll, I'd rather I'll answer the earlier one. No comment. I, plead I, the I, I, I refrain from commenting. Yeah. I'm, I don't follow any politics. You know? What is politics? Yeah. What is politics? <laughs> <laughs> Who is the most influential influencer in your opinion? Influential influencer. Influence. Sri Lankan, right? No, I was talking about Great Britain. <laughs> I can say. No, he's <laughs> Influencer. Okay, uh, I would say it's uh, Ganguly. Yeah, no. Ga Ganguly. 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 So it does all those kids with like abuse, violence, do all the fun stuff too. But it it has such a great impact. Yeah. I think it's a. For me, it's a. Yeah. Actually, I agree with you. Right? Yeah. E yeah. Like every every small. Yeah. Like detail, can I have your answers? Anyway. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> So I like Sushmita's work. Okay. She's up and coming. I quite like the effort that she puts into her work, and she tries to do something different. Right. You. She's good reach also. I think there's uh, less people, uh, less influencers as male influencers, as you said. So I would go with Ranshan for promoting brands. All right. Thank you. Uh, hmm. <laughs> I feel like no one deserves that. Actually, no one deserves it. <laughs> but <laughs> Keep questions left, right, and center. Let's just uh, leave it here. Like that. Thank you, Crystal, for joining us on the show. We are going to get into nothing. <laughs> oh, we are getting into a break. You know, there you go. We'll see you after. Welcome back to the show. It's a date with Dana. We are speaking about influencing people on social media platforms, creating a new way to sort of earn, be relevant, and at the same time, create your own market space. So if you're thinking about, you know, I don't have a location, I don't have resources, use the platforms that are freely available. And these are like living testimonies for it. Now, I wanted to speak about the COVID time. You know, we, we hated it. But at the same time, it created such a platform for people to spend a lot of time online and utilize it so well. There were some businesses that really took off. You were selling shirts when we were locked down. Yes. Where were they wearing it? So actually, I think everybody got really demotivated when uh, the COVID came and then delivery stopped and all that things happened. And uh, I remember- And you were far from essential services. Yes. Yeah. I remember Dish and I were just uh, at home and we've got some orders that we had to send. So I went to the police station, got a, uh, this thing. Permit, yeah. Permit and, I, and Dish and I, we went to the store and we packed because no staff couldn't come. Yeah. Right, and nobody could come and open the offices. So we both went, packed the orders, and replied to DMs. And say, uh, I actually drove and handed over parcels to people right, right around yes. the Colombo vicinity. And you would be surprised. I think COVID time, uh, people were actually together at home more than before. Yeah, of course. So they were celebrating everybody's birthdays, parties, and everything. So within their parameters, like yes, neighbors will Next meet to up. Yeah, and everything. So I think at that moment we just promoted saying we are delivery, 
and we are doing it in this time. Figuring out those logistics was tough. Yeah. Because and there were some people who were delivering. Yeah, logistics yeah. companies yeah. that were. Uh, Doing very well, like Celeste is a brand that grew during COVID. You yeah. all grew during Actually, COVID. Actually, like I think all the brands who stuck to their thing and just did it every day, yeah, kept it focused yes. during the time. It really worked, and it was amazing because I would see stories of like multiple yeah. shirts packed like this, and I'm like, yeah, for what? Even we were confused. <laughs> where are people going to wear this? Right? Yeah, no, and get like go. small artisans who are producing, right? And so you're they still continuing, work. yeah. yeah. Yes. And because you can't, that's will their happen. livelihood. Yeah. Yeah. And that was amazing. That's yeah. what motivates yeah. us all the time. Every right. day, yeah. Because nice there's a lot of people depending on it, and there's families who are depending on yeah. this thing. And like this that. is their bread and butter. Yes. So yeah. there's, there's so much of hope for them in this brand as yes. well, which is remarkable. Yes. Uh, how, did, um, how did COVID affect you? Oh, that's when I started uh, content TikTok. creating. Yeah. Slowly. Oh. Until then, you were just no. I didn't even have like. But well Instagram done. You have now. had a super growth. Mm -hmm. it, it, it's it's been like a crazy journey, but that's how it started. Because yeah. I got into TikTok during that time. I think I started mm -hmm. a TikTok mm -hmm. account, yeah. but then it wasn't as popular or anything. I just started, and I used to do TikToks with my grandma. Not that I posted it online or anything <laughs> like as in public. It was like a private account, but between that's you how and your grandmother. Yeah, she used to. I think there was this Detol song or something. Ah, yes, yes. She, I still have it as a draft. It's hilarious. But, um, yeah, yeah I know. We were all stuck at home. There was yeah. nothing to do. <laughs> that is true. I found your TikToks very entertaining and also motivating. I'm just like, how does she do this? Yeah, now I understand. Like She's like, just like, yeah. eating chia seeds in the morning and like living the life. <laughs> and broccoli and you chicken. Make it so bad. <laughs> and broccoli and chicken. But anyway, <laughs> uh, but yeah, COVID time was quite interesting. Like, um, I always thought. You know, people had a perception about TikTok. Ugh, what is this platform? Mm -hmm. People just dancing. Look at it today. It has become such an educational platform. Amazing. There is people who are, there are people who are teaching. There are people who are thriving in businesses. There are people who are like even just being weird. Yes, yeah. true. I well, think there are pages that literally teach you law. I, yeah. I've studied through TikTok, and people yeah. think it's a joke. Yeah. It's not. Like you can learn anything now. It's that is true. Golf, everything. You can learn it's short golf. and to the point, yeah. and you know. And it's very effective, yeah, right? Very effective. Like it's like thirty seconds, short, one. Right? Yeah, so like, right. It's very so it just. And, and people who are from an older generation who thought mm, people are just wasting time, now they have brought forward people and recruited them as digital content creators because you need that platform now. Yeah. You yes. can't live without it, which is which is remarkable. All right, it's time for a break, another competition. You know, this is just uh, tagging tag. Oh, <laughs> but y'all have been just terrible. Participation <laughs> <laughs> is what's important. It's, yeah. yeah, not <laughs> just <laughs> being <laughs> present, being <laughs> participating in it also is quite valuable. It's called yes or no. <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> Have you ever gotten scolded by your significant other in front of your friends? <laughs> <laughs> See, I respect, I respect my spouse. Today, I also created a drama for them <laughs> to get scolded. <laughs> I called and told him, don't tell, I'm just telling you. <laughs> Do you think you could like bring her quickly? <laughs> said, Donu told me. <laughs> <laughs> I was just dig with Donu. Yeah, <laughs> too bad. You. you actually just dig your own hole. Yeah. <laughs> but I have actually told him this. Marrying you and like being with you was like his greatest decision. I Haven't I told you yeah, this? Yeah, yeah. She, you made him from a boy to a man. No. In the best way possible. Thank you. I told him, he didn't pass those information to you, no? <laughs> <laughs> Things that I tell you, don't tell you tell. It's the don't tell part. Ah, that's <laughs> what I <mean. laughs> like, oh, tell. Have you ever gotten into a serious fight with a close friend's close friend over a mine issue? Oh. And I feel no. like yeah, no. I feel like it's probably happened. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Things happen. <laughs> Life goes on. I'm mine. back. <laughs> what is that word? It's very wiggly. Wiggly, wiggly. What was the string of like? Was the string of like? Have you ever fallen asleep during the act of intimacy? <laughs> no. I, I think you should not have that then. <laughs> Just go to sleep. 
it. No, but you might have started with all the energy and just... Should you just pass on? Yeah. That's have you ever been dumped by someone in public? Public? No. no Not yet, okay. No, have you <laughs> ever had strong feeling for someone who didn't have the same feelings as you did for them? Yeah, when I was a kid. Aww. Yeah, I know, it was really cute. Mm. <laughs> have you ever gotten called out at school because you were wearing something embarrassing? No, our school is just really Yeah, strict. it's beautiful. No. Yeah. Where did your school? Yes, yes. yes. Oh. <laughs> have you been so soldiers. upset that you cried yourself to sleep? Yes. You yeah. too are oh. nice. Yeah. They should lie, right? Yeah. Everybody cries. Cute. You've cried so much that you have fallen asleep? Oh yeah, that time you've fallen asleep. Cry, cry and then fall asleep. <laughs> yeah. Maybe should, everybody should be. Unless you need a good cry. Because <laughs> the crying helps. Have you ever made one of your parents cry in the past? Like for good reasons, yeah. Like what? On well, my wedding day, uh, yeah, I was like tearing. Yeah. Mm. Cute. Have you ever dated someone more than once, though you knew going back was a bad idea? Yes. <laughs> Everyone has done that. Are they? Come on. Okay. <laughs> uh, in this, I've taken away, uh, taken the gift away. Yeah, because we don't deserve it. Y'all don't, <laughs> <laughs> you <all> don't deserve <laughs> gifts. <laughs> First guests forget <laughs> gifts. <laughs> Spotty. Guess with no gifts. All right, I think it's time for a break. Breaks just come like that, you know. Just you requested this, no? I'll see you after. This. <laughs> this is one of my favorite segments, and it's called. You all have watched the show and learned. Yes. Done your homework and come yeah. no. Here we go. Oh God. <laughs> what do you do when you get the urge in public? Urge in public. If it's a good place, yeah. Huh. yeah. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> With her, no? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> because she is just no, looking you at don't create too many problems like this. What she is, is looking at you like <laughs> you <laughs> <laughs> go home. Oh. <laughs> uh, Nothing, I drink water. Huh? Nothing. Water. I just drink water. You just drink water? That's it. Oh. And for the urge to go? You said public. Yeah. You That's behave. Yeah. School taught us to behave. <laughs> right? And drinking water can stop it? Water helps with everything. You should try. Want to lose weight? Drink some water. Mm. Want to kill out. someone? Drown them. Urge? Drink some water. <laughs> okay. What's your favorite way to be seduced? <laughs> yeah, I'm waiting for her to answer. Oh, Jesus <laughs> Christ, no pressure at all. Favorite way to be seduced? Mm. Slow dance to a pole, give you roses, lick you up and down. Oh, and Lord. <laughs> My <laughs> grandma's going to watch this. Jeez. She had grandchildren. What do you think? Yeah, but different story. She's sweet. Yeah. She is sweet. She is sweet. Okay. Um, mm, I don't know. Uh, Let me lick you up and down no. until you stay. Stop. My it's a song. Yeah, just, just, just go with it. Just go with what? it. What? Uh, come on, that will let me be. Let me be. Is the, what is the question? <laughs> you don't need to answer this. I only wanted to. Yeah, you only wanted to. Oh, punishment. <laughs> it's been a tough position. Oh, you like to be in a tough position. Oh, God, no. So confused. You. What's the naughtiest fantasy you've had at work? At work? No fantasies. Because we work together? <laughs> Such a turn off. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no fantasy at all. Yeah, we'll have staff watching this, you know. Yeah. No. <laughs> you know, these no, questions no, are hypothetical. Okay. Yeah, yeah. At this point, so you could have even sent the staff off, you could have been after us. <laughs> but yet, you kept everything going at the same time. <laughs> staff is there, husband is there, and I'm imagining, no, you can't. <laughs> it's a hypothetical no question fantasies. for you to. Uh, no, nothing, nothing at all. At work, no. Right, very I bring focused. Bring work home, also yeah. asking. Yeah. <laughs> 
brings it home. <laughs> Good that you all have the car. <laughs> Shehan, I think this belongs to you. Yes. You are the only one who was very good in answering this. Yes. Look at Disha's face. <laughs> she's like, so competitive. <laughs> yeah, she's like, I'm congratulations. Same thing, Shea gets is also mine. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, but he worked for it. Yeah. What's his is mine. Yeah, and what's yours is also his. What's mine is mine. Is. Correct. Hmm. Yeah. Well done. Congratulations. Well, you, you can use it. There are some cool stuff. I'm so excited. Even self pleasure. <laughs> 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 Not that sad. <laughs> <laughs> um, have you all had um, capillary in this field that you're all in? People who have like stabbed you all, spoken uh, bad. Yeah. Oh, okay. um, like where they have crippled your growth. Yeah. Oh, right. I think everybody goes through that. Because yeah. uh, people get jealous here. People get... Uh, I, that's what I promote at my workspace also. Like if someone is doing better, do not get jealous or if someone's doing something right just know that they are doing something right and you're just getting jealous right i think our culture should change in that way and i think things will but be how better. do you all overcome it for you how was it so like i honestly think there's room in this like it, there's room for everybody you know so you don't have to be jealous like i mean sri lanka is small right then there's room for everybody to grow, to thrive. And yeah. Yes, I don't. Like especially in fashion, so. I think like it's just competition is always better. Mm. There's always something to look forward to and new things coming up. Yeah. Right. Keeps you motivated as well. Yeah. True. Um, Senori, uh, this you know you are more public due to the fact of all these online work that you do. Have you had problems with other online workers to oh, do content creators. and like? Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yes. True, true. It's um. How do I say? Sometimes you don't get to know even. Sometimes it could be like the closest people that you work with, people who actually even comment saying, "Oh my God, this is so good." They might even share it and tag it on their page as well. But um. Like she said, it's, it's a small world, especially Colombo crowd. It's quite small. It's not like there are millions of influencers. It's the same content creators that's around. So you get to know from someone. Sometimes the agency might say, oh, look, uh, X person said this about you. Or doesn't want to work with you. Doesn't want to work with you. I have said no to you yeah, a few um, times. Oh, yeah. That's fine. That's said fine. no, Sonori. <laughs> oh, oh. Good Lord. Yeah, like, yeah. Who cares? But then... Um, <laughs> oh, it, guys, it, I'm happy. It's, <laughs> it's how it works. works. But there's nothing you can do about it also. That's true. It, you just go with it. You just roll and next yeah, time you see them, you smile yeah. in their yeah, face. Business, and everyone's right? entitled exactly. to their own you opinion. Can't get and everything no, business, you can't right? let the emotional... By the way, it was not true what I said. Although I can be very realistic when I say something. I am. I believe that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it is what it is. But, um, but have you, like, has this made you stronger? Because I think if not for this, your life would have been very different. You would have been a lawyer. You are a lawyer, but I'm just saying. Oh, you would going have, to be. Yeah, you would have focused on that. And, you know, it would have been very different. You would have had a stronger personal life where people's opinions would have not even, like, come your way. Yeah, that's true. That's true. Of, of course it makes you stronger. Uh, I think that's like the breaking point. It's either you become strong or you just fall down. So it's, it's up to you how to take it and move forward. But for me, of course, thankfully, I've been able to take all the negativity and just somehow fix it, be positive about it. So, yeah. That's been amazing. That's amazing. But something that I really like about this brand is the fact that they always use everything local, from the people to the... They're happy to just have everyone from this country yes. wearing their clothes and gets on the grid because they are happy about it. And that's, yes. that's something that's amazing. And I love that fact. And we, we produce it for Sri Lankans. Yeah. Dishan and we love Sri Lanka, like so we, we want do. to promote. Yeah. yeah. As much Island as boy, yeah. island girl. Yes. yes. Island girl at heart. Yeah. The, only, or the other only place that they can move to is, I think, Maldives or something. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, yeah, somewhere like that. <laughs> we have a break time. When we do come back, I'm going to be showing some interesting photographs that I was able to pick and choose uh. from the World Wide Web. <laughs> So 
So what's on their Facebook? Because you know, we can't go onto Instagram or any other platform and take a look at it just because it's too modern, there are filters, people have just made them so it looks prettier. But on Facebook, you get tagged on some terrible pictures. Yeah. So I thought, let's go back in time and read about it and like come to know about the memories behind these photographs. First one. <laughs> I saw this one recently. Oh. I love it. So yeah. he's the star on the tree. <laughs> you see the piece? <laughs> Tell me about this. That was in uh, Candy Gateway. Uh, oh, you in Candy? Yes, I was in Candy Gateway oh. for a while. Yeah, good times. Good times, no? All yeah. of them are still just <laughs> friends of Still your friends, yeah. no, actually. That's really amazing. Good friends. Show me your eyebrows. Not yours. Mine? Yours? Yeah. You have, right? For some odd reason, here you don't seem to be having eyebrows. <laughs> um, if it, oh. That's the field. <laughs> oh my gosh, do you know when that was taken? Mm. Must be the uh, <laughs> when he visited me in uni in Nottingham. Yeah. Oh wow. Uh, probably like 2014. 2014. Oh. Yeah, like oh my gosh, almost 10 years ago. Yeah. Less less fat. <laughs> Please, there's no fat skinny at all. Days. Yeah, skinny days. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, do you not have eyebrows in that? Yeah, no eyebrows. Wow. Lord. That's you. Yeah. Where is it? It's girl guiding. Yeah. That's you. Oh, yeah. oh. So cute. Oh, thanks. So you were a girl guide? Yes, I was. And how was your girl guide life? Fantastic. So you know how to like, you know, like put a knot. Yeah. Oh, it, it's part of the deal, right? We have exams and stuff. So you can pass knots to too. stitching your own uniform. Oh, really? Cooking, camping, everything. Gardening, whatnot. It, it's a whole package. I have wow. learned how to make tea. Amazing. That, yeah. <laughs> That's how a start. To go to the puller, yeah. Can you pass this to her? <laughs> of course. Thank you. I'm here for you. This is a music. Yeah. Before oh. an Instagram influencer, she was. Oh my God! So oh, wow. that phone is my first phone. My ma my parents didn't buy me. My neighbor gave her phone to me. <laughs> hey, I tried getting one. They weren't like very supportive. I love it. So <laughs> I got my neighbor's old phone. That's at Amante race course, I think. Oh, uh, okay. Right after my A-levels, if I'm not missed, I don't know. I can't remember. 2016, 15? <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Do I have braces in there? No, right? No. Ah, that's when they took off my braces. Probably like the Celebration. week after or some shit. Mm. <laughs> Aww, that's Aww. with my baby bother. <laughs> <laughs> With an R. <laughs> no, no, he has grown into quite the... Man. Man. No. But it's a beautiful picture yeah. though. At my Hello. 18th birthday. Can I see? Anne. That's, that's she at oh. my 18th birthday. Oh, oh I, I dressed him up in the bow tie. Yeah. And <laughs> that's the first time someone has had the like... Really? Give me an outfit. <laughs> how, so how many years have you all known each other? 10 years? Ten? We've been dating yeah. for about 10. We started dating about 10 years ago. Wow. It's, uh, that's a lot. 2013. Really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. So you all pack up and like leave on a lot of trips. This is one of those? Yeah. No, I think this is this this also a trip. event for a shoot. pop Tambili up shoot. or something. Where was this? Tambili shoot. Ah. Yeah. yeah. She's like, yay, yeah, shoot. <laughs> yeah. Oh no. The wink. The but um, <laughs> where is I my head? <laughs> but, but the dress is stunning. Oh, uh, it, it was nice. for um, I think it was a comparing event at school. Yeah, I was not being nice about the dress, yeah, but, but yeah. <laughs> no, no, I'm just telling you. <laughs> That's what it was. But Curly it's nice. Hair. Hideous makeup Cute though. Oh my god, they made I me the white. Makeup. No, that's no, a I, I or something. Uh, I guess. God, my face was white. Very nice. But I love the transformation. No, right? Here you go. Up, yeah. I kept this picture for Aww. last. Aww. Aww. You were there. Nice you were there. <laughs> Who's in the middle? I'm not there. No, you were no, there. I, I was at were. the wedding, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was not in the <laughs> picture. But yeah, it's a beautiful photograph. Thank you. So, you all were pretty young when you all got married. You all are still young. Yeah, no? You all were like what? Were you two years ago. Uh, you were married two years ago. Yeah, I was 26. Twenty-four. Twenty-four. Gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. 
Nice. That's like my age and I'm still not married. <laughs> <laughs> no race. <laughs> <laughs> there you go, that's for you. Thank you. Anyway, it's amazing to see young new people coming forward, doing oh, things. Lovely. If you have seen the brand and not exactly know who the founders or creators were of it, now you know. Uh, simple, easygoing guys, love the country. They're staying back, although they have all the chances to yes. be in other places of the world. So it's, that's, that's the most refreshing thing, having all of you all here. Don't back up and go, okay? Yeah, please. Yeah. I'm not going. Good. Yeah, yeah. Good. It's just I really want people to be here. Otherwise, I'll very soon I'll start talking to the chair. <laughs> There'll be nobody here. Yeah, actually, there's yeah. nobody. So well done. Thank you for being staying well, in our country. Yeah. And that's that's important. All right. On that note, we might starve and all very soon, but at least we'll pull through. At least together, guys. Yeah. yeah. Like Positive this time. Yeah, I will have to eat your shirt soon. <laughs> <laughs> I have a lot of it. <laughs> yeah. Number one. Yeah. yeah number one. Next time. No, it's, it's okay. <laughs> All right, on that note, we need to wrap things up. Uh, thank you for being on the show with us. We will see you soon. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Yes, thank, you. thank you very much. But really, right? Okay. <laughs> All right, on that note, we will say wrap up. Uh, take care, everyone. Good night.